Hello, everybody. It's Happy Thursday time. Thank you all for coming. This is an interesting story. This is a story of compounding and staking. And it's a story of how you can turn $100,000 into $64 million. I know it'll sound crazy, but bear with me. It has a few little caveats to that. But it also, just what a special time it is to be alive and how lucky we all are. So thank you all for coming. I'm going to talk about the staking process in Solana, what it means, trust and delegation. Uh, but there is also a little risk with staking too, you have to bear in mind as well. But it really is the story of the eighth wonder of the world. So let's go. Thank you all for coming. And of course, this is not financial advice. Don't forget, unique content every single day that you will not find anywhere else. Thank you all for coming. Now, the idea behind this was a post I made as a quiz to the community last week. And I was just thinking out loud and I said, well, Raul Paul has $400 to $600 target per sol. He actually has $500 to 1000 now in a recent interview. But just imagine if he's right. But of course, I like to sandbag stuff. But imagine if your sol cost basis is $20 or $10 or whatever, and the price goes to 400 and your staking rewards are 7%, what is the effective staking return on your bag in percentage terms, assuming the cost remains at $20 and the price goes to $400? Well, I started digging into that and creating models around it, and it's really fascinating. That's what I'm going to walk you all through today. So first of all, the power of compounding and staking. Compounding is a process of earning interest on your interest, and of course, your your initial investment too. But when you stake your cryptocurrency, you're not only earning rewards on your initial investment, but also on your staking rewards. And this can lead to huge growth over time. And sometimes it's mind blowing to think about this, <sighs> but it's special. So what is staking? This is when you as a Solana token holder can stake your tokens by delegating them to validators, increasing the validators voting weight, and this process does not transfer ownership or control of the tokens to the validators. But by staking with certain validators, token holders express trust in them. And the more stake a validator receives from various holders, the more network views their consensus votes as trustworthy. That's basically how it works. And there is consensus via proof of stake. The network achieves consensus by weighing the validators' votes against the proportion of stake delegated to them within the whole proof of stake mechanism. So that's kind of, you don't need to know too much about that, but it's important to be aware of as well. But I want to go back in history and talk about one of the eighth wonders of the world. And Albert Einstein said, compound interest is the eighth wonder of the world. He who understands it, earns it. He who doesn't, pays it. Remember, the vast majority pay it. And that's a problem. Remember that. Just look at this burn it into your brain. It is absolutely critical. Um, but Warren Buffett also said that compound interest is an investor's best friend, and he compared building wealth through interest to rolling a snowball down a hill. I love that analogy. And I got a picture of kind of what it means, the snowball effect of the magic of compounding. You start small, things start gaining momentum, like you buy an asset at $10, it goes to 400 and it's earning interest, but your cost basis is $10. That's the point. To the point of no stopping, faster than ever, and boom, you can get a really big bag of something in a short amount of time. That is the power of what we're going to discuss today and break down. Well, but there are a couple of other things as well. Staking rewards are typically calculated as a percentage of your state crypto. An exact amount of return you get depends on the blockchain, commissions, the validator, etc. And payouts are typically paid on a daily, weekly, or monthly basis, I had a rude surprise. I thought my cost basis for Solana was about $21.90 until I factored in all my staking rewards. Now it is under $20, and that is stunning to think about as well. So it has a huge impact in a short window of time on your actual cost basis as well. So think about that. Now I'm going to break down 10 years of staking as a hypothetical as to what the power of compounding means. And in this slide, imagine you bought 10,000 Solana at $10 at the bottom. Uh, I actually bought uh, Solana at under $10 at the bottom, but I had a cost basis and my focus was reducing my cost basis from stacking for nearly three years. Anyhow, I managed to do that very effectively. But if you invested $100,000 in Solana at $10, you get 10,000 Solana 
Okay, these are just hypothetical numbers, not saying what you should have or what you have or what I have. I'm just walking through some simple mathematics here. And you can get nearly 10,000 Solana back from staking on a compound basis in 10 years. So I blew up the the numbers there. Your 10,000, you get about 1.85 Sol per day, 13 every seven days, every 30 days, about 55 and a half. Every year, about 675. But that bag grows and the compounding grows. And that 10,000 Sol becomes 19,652 Sol. Nearly double. Now, if, if, this is the interesting part here. How $100,000 goes to $64 million. Again, it's mind melting. I know. But it's also technically very possible. And I've seen it happen to other people with other assets. I know people who bought Home Depot 40 years ago or Walmart or something like this. And literally a small position can become huge. And we're not talking 100,000, we're talking 5,000 or 10,000 can become many millions. And that's what I want you to all, all to understand. But now we're talking about staking as well. So if we take this example here, we initially invest, I don't need to be zoomed out for that, but you see it on the screen. You initially invest $100,000, you get 10,000 solid $10, okay? So your initial investment is 100,000. But if Vanek is right and the price of Solana goes to 3,200 by 2030, let's say 2032, let's say 10, 11, nine years from now, who cares? Let's say 10 years, 2033, then your bag, $100,000 bag goes to $64 million with that 1,900, 19,652 Solana. That's how 100,000 goes to 64 million. But there's more. Let's go through some more examples here as well. Now, imagine a scenario, depending on your cost basis, and I'll share this model on Patreon as well, so you can all play with it later. But imagine you bought Sol during the dip. I know a lot of people that bought under 10, and that is very close to their cost basis. But we'll assume $10 and $20 cost basis. You stake your Sol, and the staking rewards are, say, 6.76%. I, You know, we'll call it 7%. That was one of the lowest ones. You can get sometimes as high as 8%, but we'll just call it 7%. And the price goes to my conservative IA price target of $151 or $298 during this bull run. Okay, following me so far? This is how these numbers came about. This is my hypothetical price targets based on last bull run and comparables to other tokens. And the average of today and all-time high is $151. In fact, as we speak, you know, literally Solana was... Um, it was $45 on Friday evening when I grabbed more. Now it's like 66. So it's gone up uh, nearly 45% in just a couple of days. So this thing moves fast. And I see, actually speaking of that, we have Bitcoin nearly at 38,000 as well. Anyway, moving on. You can see here the two price targets, uh, the average of the history, 151 bucks. I think is very achievable now. My target before was $100, so I've upped it. And the total bull case, which is the 0.9 percentile of all the other targets, is $298. Now we're going to run those through some numbers and see what we come up with. So this first scenario is stake and reward ROI on original investment with a $20 cost basis and four targets. So we have Raul Paul say 400. He actually said 500 recently as well. We just go with 400 for giggles. Cost basis is 20. You've got 10,000 tokens. Staking reward is 7%. Your capital gains, if you were to sell, would be $380, but that doesn't include taxes on your staking rewards too. And your effective staking return is $280,000. Your fair market value, if Solana goes to 400, goes to $4 million. Cost basis, 200,000. And most importantly, the ROI on initial investment just from staking is 140%. So you're making 280 grand on 200 grand. This is the part I want you to all get. It's massive. And the ROI on initial investment with staking is 2,040%. Massive. Now, we go to the Vanek bull target. Imagine 3,200. Again, cost basis 20%. That takes us to literally a bag that's worth $34 million at the end of this period. The staking ROI from your stake is 1120% and your ROI on initial investment with staking is 17,000%. Of course, I don't expect Vanek to happen 
but it could happen by 2030. They believe it's their bull case. It could potentially happen. So just bear with me here. Now, my two targets, my bear is $151. Now, the staking ROI on your initial investment is 52.85% because you make the effective staking return of 105700 on your 200000 investment. And that's and your total ROI on the investment is 708%. Now, the bull target, $298. If that does happen, remember the all-time high is 260. So 290 is not a huge stretch. You got 10,000 tokens. Your, your effective stake in return is 208,600. Fair market value is $3 million. Plus your stake in rewards goes to total bag is about 3.2 million. And that's 1,500% return. And that's on a $20 cost basis. Now imagine Imagine you have a $10 cost basis. What does this all mean? And this is where it gets really crazy. So you have, again, instead of investing 200,000, you invest 100,000. Okay, that's your original cost basis. It goes to a fair market value at Raul Paul's target of 400 bucks. That's $4 million. Plus, you're making your staking return of 280,000. So your total ROI on the initial investment with staking is 4,180%. Vanek, 34,000%. I know these are mind-melting numbers, but bear with me here. And my bear target, 1,500%. Your $100,000 becomes a bag of 1.6 million. And if it does go $298, your $100,000 bag goes to 3.2 million or 3,100% return. This is the power of investing. Now, <laughs> When I made my retire, my retire on videos, people thought I was crazy and nuts, but they didn't understand the power of compounding. Okay, now people are beginning to get it. This is one example. I made this in March 2023, an update to retire on Solana. And at the time, I can't remember what the bag cost, but you, if you were assuming the bull case, you only needed 320 Solana. Okay. 320 Solana at $10 is 3,200 bucks to retire in 10 years. Amazing to think. And if you're staking, you only need 236 Solana. This is what I was trying to get at many years ago. Many of you are following this plan though, and fingers crossed you're on the right track. Uh, but people were saying I was crazy. No, I just do mathematics and I understand compounding. So I want to share that with you all. Uh, but there are risks. I would be neglect if I didn't point out the risks. There's risks of slashing. It hasn't apparently happened yet. There's smart contract risk, centralization risk, liquidity risk, and market risk. Slashing, by the way, is a process by which validators can be penalized for malicious behavior or negligence. But it's not like they're going to take all of your tokens. They can't do that. So from that perspective, it might be a tiny haircut. So don't be too terrified of that as well. Um, a smart contract risk, uh, a smart contract could have a bug and that could deliver a problem and there could be an exploit and funds could maybe be stolen. Who knows? Uh, centralization. Uh, this could pose a risk to network security and not having enough decentralization, etc. and all the other stuff. But again, the power of compounding far outsizes the risks. And therefore, when you do stake, make sure you apportion it carefully, spread it all around. Don't have everything in one basket as you go forward. And a big thank to everybody on Patreon too. Cheers, everybody. Thank you all for being part of the biggest and smartest finance community in the world. I appreciate each and every one of you and hope you enjoy the video. Don't forget, uh, don't have all your eggs in one basket, but staking and the power of compounding is very, very, very powerful for us to all get out of the rat race. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Bye-bye.